keep them pulling a lot. Same with that one. Soul Rock and <gasps> Secret Rare. It's a secret. Celestial Storm. Celestial Storm. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to an opening of an English Celestial Storm Pokemon Cards Booster Box. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this will be an early opening of the very, very brand new Pokemon Sun and Moon Booster Box that is not coming out until August, but pre-release events start this weekend in just a few days. And I am so excited about this very brand new set because one, look at the artwork on the box. It is absolutely gorgeous. We got Rayquaza on the cover with that beautiful emerald shade of green on the booster box. We got Jirachi on this side and of course, the back of the box, which some very cool cards that I am looking hopefully to pull in this booster box. So if you are excited, ladies and gentlemen, for Celestial Storm, not only hit that like button, but please comment in the comment section your favorite Celestial Storm card that I pull from this video. And if you do that and subscribe, you just may win a sealed pre-release Celestial Storm box. So be on the lookout for that. And yes, I'll be opening up another Celestial Storm pre-release box in just a day or so. So be sure to subscribe if you are excited for that and anything Celestial Storm because it is going to be so much Celestial Storm on this channel. Nature's Wrath in full fury. So you get a new Articuno GX card, Blaziken, some new Prism Star cards. Those are always gorgeous. And of course... Latios, Latias, and a Jirachi card, or cards, plural. So there's the top of it. We got a Blaziken on there, and I'm going to start opening this new Celestial Storm box. And as I am, everybody, if y'all could please go subscribe and check out my Leonhart Plays Let's Play channel here on YouTube. There will be a link in the comment section below, as well as in the description below, more importantly. Check it out. I've been playing Pokemon Fire Red. And it has been a lot of fun, so please go subscribe to my Leonhart Plays YouTube channel. All right, look at that. That is gorgeous. Nothing like the smell of new booster packs or an early booster box opening. So, let's take a look at all the artworks. And of course, you can also comment this for your chance to win that pre-release box. Look, <laughs> Love that. Very nice one there. So, uh, I think that should be it. Oh. I just think a Rayquaza pack is gorgeous. Reminds me of the Shining Legends pack. So there's the first one. Celestial Storm, Blaziken. Oh, Jirachi is also gorgeous too. So these are, these are all absolutely fantastic. But please do let me know in the comment section your favorite pack artwork. All right. Just so you know, I am going to go a little bit slower as far as that the beginning goes, just so everybody can get their full take of not only the Pokemon cards in general, what they look like, the artworks, um, but just to see the types of moves and everything that they do as well. And of course, since it's sun and moon, we get to do Lean Hearts trademark patented guess the energy game. You're gonna love this if you're new to the Heart Squad, everybody. So, you guess an energy, psychic. All right, that's pretty much it. And then you get a pat on the back if you get it. So let us begin this Celestial Storm Pokemon Cards Booster Box opening, starting off with a gorgeous Sableye, the Mask Royal. And uh, I don't know basically any cards. I've not seen a Japanese booster box of this open door anything. So this is going to be completely new to me, as it is hopefully to all of y'all out there. So hopefully y'all enjoy this. Low Tad. C dots, and I love it. There's many of them on the uh, trees. Beldum, Alolan Rattata. Probably gonna pull this card a lot, but it is a very nice looking card with all the colors. There's, of course, Voltorb, and Voltorb is always pitched off at something. Energy Switch. That is a very retro looking card, especially from like the EX series, it reminds me of. Very cool. And the first rare is. A Delmis non-holographic anchor. <laughs> it's pretty cool. All right, so that's the first one. Very nice. We'll go with the very next pack and uh, see what we can do. I actually, I really do think the artwork is very, very nice looking here. So we'll see if the pull rates also are the same. Fighting energy. Nope. Nose goes on that. 
here we go. Rainbow Brush. Super Mario would be very nice for that card. Apricorn Maker. Don Fan. The artwork on that card reminds me of like Wizards of the Coast series. Very cool. <laughs> Shoop, there it is. Very nice. Mudkip. Bagons be Bagons. Whismer. Trico. Gotta say, I am liking the illustration so far. New Orleans Pelicans. And oh yes, what a way to begin this opening. A Rayquaza GX. We got the mascot himself. A Rayquaza GX. And the best part is we don't even need to go to like a skyscraper or something like that to catch this guy. We just pulled a Rayquaza GX ultra rare card. Stormy Winds is the ability. Dragon Break. And of course, Tempest GX. Card 109 out of 168. Very, very nice. And what do you know? Going to open up the pack himself. Granted, we have lots and lots of packs because this will be a full Celestial Storm booster box opening. So put it on your seatbelts and get excited because it's the Guess the Energy game. Fire. So far, nose goes on the Guess the Energy game. Hustle Belt. Volbeat. Combuskin. Interesting. Jumping on some lava there. Spoink. Electric, Surskit, Onyx. I am really liking these old typey, uh, or just it just like sketches. They're really nice. Clam Pearl, Rare Candy, and ooh, Deoxys. Breaking the sound barrier over here. It's almost in a uh, space, but it's not in space, so can't really shout out the word space like we did for the Forbidden Light series, which is the previously released Pokemon card set. But now we got some new Pokemon cards, and if you're going to a pre-release event, definitely let me know in the comment section. Lightning! Oh, now we got Psych. Yeah, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It's always fun going to those pre-release events. Underground Expedition. Nice, uh, nice face there. Minior, Surskit, Slugma, Larvitar, Whismur, Bellsprout! I love Bellsprout! Such a cute Pokemon, and there's a bunch of them! There's four of them! Just chilling in the prairie or something. Beldum and the ra- Oh! Oh, how's it going? I am ready for my interview. TV reporter, full art trainer supporter card. That is gorgeous. She's ready for some brown nosing right now. TV reporter. That is a gorgeous looking card. And what a way. We, all right, I'm already happy. I. Hopefully, we still got so much of the booster box to go, Hard Squad. And uh, we've already gotten a full art trainer supporter card and, of course, a Rayquaza GX. Don't forget, guys, if y'all would like to represent the uh, Heart Squad, check out the Teespring link in the description below to get some Heart Squad Leonhardt merch like this one and plenty other ones for girls and guys and kids. Please do check it out. I don't know if I did the Guess the Energy game. Yeah, I did, but hopefully y'all guessed it because I was on a little tangent there. Oh, TV reporter, we just got your card. Very nice. I think that was a Loudred in the back of it. Last Chance Potion, Voltorb, Slugma, Surskit. I'm actually very, very happy right now. I think the centering, well, the centering, yeah, I think the centering's been pretty great. That was something that was not the same in the other packs. A plus all, reverse holographic. I love when the pair of them comes together. It's also the Tokyo 2020 Winter <laughs> Summer Olympics coming up. And a Tyranitar holographic card. Our first holographic Pokemon card. This one really reminds me of EX Team Rocket Returns. I don't know, like, there's a Tyranitar card, I believe, in Team Rocket Returns, and this almost reminds me of the color scheme and everything, but a very gorgeous looking Tyranitar holographic card. Getting a Jirachi would be pretty cool as well, but I am Articuno, I mean, I love the legendary birds, I don't know about y'all. Getting a Articuno GX, I believe it's a full art maybe, I don't know, uh, Leaf. Ugh, I was almost going to say lightning. Would be very cool to get that uh, Articuno. All right, Sableye. A Kecleon. Ball toy. Wingle. With a little, like, sailboat in the back. That's pretty cool. Metatite with a bundle bee in the back. C dot dot dot. Or was that a Diggersby? I didn't see. Clamporal. Volbeat. And another non-holographic card. 
All right, so we, it's our first repeat rare. <laughs> Why you doing that to me, Pokemon? Why you doing that? But yeah, guys, I really do mean check out my Lean Heart Plays channel here on YouTube. It's uh, it's a lot of fun. We're not only just going to play Pokemon as well, but we'll be playing tons and tons of other random Let's Plays. Uh, fire. Gosh, it's the opposite of fire. Fine, be that way. TV reporter, we've already got you. Lifer from Resident Evil 2. A Gorbice. Pretty cool. Bagons be Bagons. Shoop, there it is. Mudkip. Alolan Rattata. <laughs> Slack on. <laughs> Having a good old day. Voltorb. That is a gorgeous reverse holographic card. Even though it's just a common, it's, it's really cool with the lightning energies on it. And a Regice. Coming into the Hoth base from Star Wars or something on that card, but pretty cool looking card. All right, next up, another Jirachi pack. Celestial Storm. Uh, it is an early booster box opening of Celestial Storm, so hopefully y'all are excited for that and for your pre-release events coming up in just a couple days. I'll say Psychic. Lightning! I wish this was like a live stream. Maybe I'll do like a live stream sometime soon and y'all can tell me like we did before. Uh, when we guessed the energy game and I listened to what y'all said. <laughs> Nuzleaf. Bagon. It's a really happy one there. Bell Sprout again. I really like that card. I like this card. I know it's just a fan fee, but I like the artwork. Very, very, very nostalgic. I put them skitty on that. Very nostalgic artwork for this set. And a Registeel. It's reminding me of like EX Hidden Legends or whatever that set was where... Actually, I'm forget. I think it was, or maybe it was at Legend Maker. I'm not exactly sure. Where there were the Gold Stars, were the uh, Registeel, Reg Ice, and uh, I'm forgetting the other one. So, here we go. Guess the energy game. I'll say Fairy. Ah, I was gonna say Psychic, but I thought I just sent Psychic, so it didn't make sense. Tropius, Hiker. <laughs> He's so happy. Is that a Salandit in the back? Oh my gosh. He's like, hi, how's it going? Energy switch, very nostalgic again. Larvitar, Whelmer. Oh, that's a really cool looking card. It looks like it's like literally in like a Pokemon map from Game Boy with the bridge and the, what is that on the side? It looks like a Pokemon gym on the side, but y'all y'all can take a closer look at that one. Bell Sprouts, the Chin, Metatite, Onyx Reverse, and the rare is a Ludicolo holographic card. Interesting to note. Well, I thought it was a different design of holographic, but it's just how they do the holographicies on these cards. This one's a little bit more like straight and smoother, and this one just has more like curves. So, curves. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Onyx, you're just a common. What happened to you? Used to be very, very cool way back when. All right, next up, Rayquaza. How you doing? How's it going? You treated me some trouble right there opening up that pack. There is the code for that one. Guess the energy game, everybody. I'll say water because I haven't said it. <laughs> it's always the opposite of what I say. Ooh, Pokenav. Pretty cool. Scyther! There's so many awesome grass Pokemon in this set. Scyther, one of my favorite Pokemon. Gorgeous looking card. Also an uncommon energy recycle system. They're always like, do your part, everybody in the Pokemon community. Make sure you recycle. Metatite, the Chin, Gulpin, Cacnea, Torchic. Pretty cool. I think it's the first one we pulled. Reverse is a Whismer with a Beware in the background chasing him. That's hilarious. And an Ultra Beast Cartana. Just regular. I was wanting to say Cartana GX because we pulled that card before. But look at that. Slicing the buildings in the background hopefully that's not a pokemon or a person in the background so cool ultra beast card our first ultra beast we still haven't pulled a prism star card because apparently there are new prism star cards to come so that will be very very interesting to see if we do by the way i am giving away a celestial storm pre-release box so make sure to subscribe put on notification bell button uh like this video and comment your favorite card or artwork that you see pulled in today's video i'll say fighting Leaf, of course, always. Shellgon, Hustle Belt. That may be. I don't know. Are there, well, I'm interested to see if there's secret rares. Whismer, Bell Sprout, Wilmer, Beldum, Spoink, Hiker. I'm guessing that's a full art trainer supported card, but it'll be interesting. Usually you don't get two, but you never know. Maybe we will get lucky and we will get two. So, I like the pulls. I mean, we have lots of packs to go to. Lots and lots of packs to go to of Celestial Storm, but the pools have been kind of slow. I mean, they were great at the beginning. There was like, we got in 
fantastic cards from this box so far, but lots and lots to go. Fire. Yay! That means I get a big old pat on the back. I can't do it this way. If you try doing it with like your opposite arm, like the left one, I'm right-handed. It's very difficult to do it that way. There's some random non-useful advice for the heart squad. Fisherman. Oh, pretty cool. Wonder if that's a card. Pupitar, a full art trainer card. Kecleon, Bagon, Whismer, Trico, Trico again, Whismer, Sky Pillar. Pretty cool looking card. And Claydol, non-holographic rare with 110 HP. Alrighty then. Lots and lots of packs to go in this Celestial Storm Pokemon cards booster box opening. This is the newest set that is coming out. I think it's August 3rd, but I haven't looked it up exactly. Uh, water. Oh, there goes the streak of two in a row. At least we got one, though. Sky Pillar again. Torkoal. Lure Ball. Flip three coins for each head. Put an Evolution Pokemon from your discard pile into your hand. The Love Disc. Very nice. Trico. Put some skitty on that. Spinner Arc. Bagon. Huntel. Oh, I thought that was a reverse rare, but I do like the artwork for that one. And the rare is a slacking holographic card. Just strutting stuff right there. I like this card. It's very like, they like make the back all blurry, kind of like a portrait shot with an iPhone or something. And he's just, he's just in the jungle, he's just posing for us, just minding his own little day and stuff. Celestial Storm, next pack coming up right here. And uh, I just also want to just reiterate, like I've done in other videos, thank y'all so much for being such an amazing community, the Horror Squad. I really do appreciate y'all supporting the channel. Um, I'll go with the water. Ooh, I haven't said metal at all. I really feel like I should say. Tokyo 2020, Pokenav, Vigoroth. I think that's a new card. Dot. Looking good. I kind of like this one better than the other one, just because of the water. Spoink, the chin, Onyx, Fisherman again, and a Mag Cargo non-holographic rare card. Alrighty then. Actually, I'll just go ahead and take the packs out, because a lot of people like seeing how gorgeous. Yeah, we got we got lots of packs. Lots of packs to go in the Celestial Storm, and ain't no splitting up this video either. You are getting the full new Pokemon booster box of the newest set to come out. I'll say, I'm gonna go metal now. Oh, dark energy. I knew there was one that I should have also done. New Orleans Pelicans, Soul Rock, Resident Evil, Gulpin, Cacnea, Torchic, Shupit. It's a funny card, I always like that one now. Mudkip, Shupit again, and a Deoxys again. Such, with the Aurora Borealis in the back. Very interesting card. Deoxys cards are always, uh, they're pretty nice, especially the, uh, the whole series EX Deoxys, I think is a absolute gorgeous set. I think it came out in like the early 2000s. Uh, I'll go with Dark Energy. Fighting Energy. Fine. All right. Let's see what we can do. Torkoal, Oricorio, Illumis, Trico, Cacnea, Mudkip, Slugma. Beldum, Spoink in the rare is an explode. Very cool. Look at the moves on that guy. Heavy impact, 100, and dangerous concert. That's a pretty good card. Very nice. All right, Blaziken, you are up. It's been a while. It's been a while. I think it's time that we got like an ultra rare or a hyper rare or something of the sorts. But let's see if we can just get the guess the energy game. I'll say lightning, fire. All right. Hopefully y'all have been doing a little bit better. All right, Friend Ball. It's kind of cool. Mawile. Interesting, with a little like uh, waterfall in the background. Mudkip, Torchic, Whismer, Cacnea, the reverse is Skitty. And a Regirock. That was the other one I was thinking of with the Registeel, Regice, and Regirock. All righty then. Next up, we got our pal Blaziken again. I'm really wanting to pull one of the newer cards. I really wanting that. Guess the energy game. I'll go with water. Fairy. Maybe the first fairy the one that we pulled. Switch. I really feel that this is from one of the e early 2000s EX series, and they've literally used the exact same artwork on this. Pretty cool, though. Like I have no problem with them doing that. So, Grovile. Lantern, just because it really does make it that much more nostalgic. Skitty, Alolan Rattata, 
tour chick. The reverse is a mud cap. Very nice. And mag cargo non holographic rare card. All right, so I'm going to move these cards over just real quick, just because I don't want to knock over any of the cards, and there's a lot of cards. So, you know what I'm saying. All right, next pack, we got two Rayquaza packs coming up. Come on, Rayquaza. If there is a hyper rare of you, I would really, really like to pull that right now. All right, I'll say maybe Leaf? Ah, oh, Fairy. All right. Bill's Maintenance. Cool. Masquerade, Plessel, Spitter Arc, Larvitar, Slack Off. The Love Disc, Electric Friend Ball, and the Rare is a Grumpig. It's a very happy-go-lucky Grumpig. He's having a great day. Lots of mud. All right, Rayquaza! See, this is the next Rayquaza pack. I'm really, really hoping that we can uh, pull something good. Hyper Rare, Secret Rare, anything. All right, Fire. Dark Energy! Acro Bike! Last Chance Potion. Ooh, Lysia. How's it going? She's running like a circus or something. Alolan Rattata, Slackoth, Surskit, Slugma. Whoa! Larvitar, the reverse Explode. So that is a reverse rare. I think that may be like our first reverse rare holographic card. And the rare is a Kyogre holographic card. You can barely tell it's a holographic because there's so much like water and waves around them. Look at that. Pretty cool. All right. Hey that, that, hey, that counts. It's a holographic card. So, Kyogre holographic card. All right. Next up, let's see if we can get two great pulls in a row. Well, that was a good pack. That was a really good pack. A reverse rare. Fire. Ooh, okay. Well, that was a great pack. Combuskin. Lycia. Beast Ball. Love Dis. Spinner Arc. Torchic. Slackoth. Shoop, there it is. Grovile and the rare is a Salamence holographic card. So that's two holographics in a row. Just so you can see, Dragon Claw 100 damage with the Dragon Wind ability. Very cool looking card. Like the blue just shines. Blue is obviously my favorite color, but I think like I've never really thought of like what is my second favorite color until somebody asked that in the Harm Squad recently to me, and I was like, I guess green. None of that, like, random color, forest green or something, but... Oh! How convenient that the Gusty Energy game would be also Leaf Energy. And Energy Switch with a leaf on it. Lombre, Mawile, Onyx, Sneasel, Bagon, Ball Toy, Beldum, Kyogre, Reverse Rare Holographic, and... Oh! Welcome when you... Bane, it's like... Like, welcome to my tea party. Come on in, even though I have a zipper on my mouth. So, pretty cool. Or creepy looking card, I guess I would more say. But it's cool nonetheless. Alrighty then. Next pack up right now. And uh, by the way, I did want to mention, uh, we're close to raising $3,000 for the Child Mind Institute that raises money and helps out people and children and adults for mental health. Uh, if y'all would like to go check out that video, I opened up every single booster pack there is with an amazing person named Nick. And uh, you can go check out that video. It will be in the eye over here. Along with, I went to Vintage Pokemon Card Heaven again this past weekend. It was such an amazing experience. Jason from Limitless Games, aka Vintage Pokemon Card Heaven, he gave an exclusive tour of the entire place. And it was a lot of fun. He showed us his private collection. He showed us parts of the store that you can't even walk up to. It's very, very cool. Super scoop up. I feel like that's also new. Weeping Bell. It's the first time we pulled a Weeping Bell, I think. Gosh, for just an uncommon card, it's pretty rare. Alolan Rattata, Torchic, Metatite, which we've been pulling a lot. Same with that one. Solrock, and... <gasps> oh, baby, yes! That is absolutely gorgeous! A secret rare! It's a secret rare! Super Mario Rainbow Brush. I feel like I got spit everywhere. Oh my gosh. That is absolutely gorgeous. A Rainbow Brush 182 out of 168 card. That is beautiful. Gorgeous looking card. Choose an energy card attached to one of your Pokemon. Search your deck. 
for a basic energy card and switch it with that card. Shuffle for the first energy card into your deck. Beautiful looking card. Hard Squad, we did it. We got our first secret rare of Celestial Storm. Hoping for many more to come as we continue to open up packs. Not only in this opening, which you probably won't get any more in this box, but... And who could? It could be in one of the pre-release boxes. It could be in random packs, so we'll see. Uh, I'll go with Psychic. Ah, all right. I'm still beaming after that suit, uh, secret rare card. Underground Expedition, Minior, Spinner Arc, Bagon. Bagon! Lots of Bagons. This is another shoot. Nope. Mudkip, Sableye, and a Claydol. Non-holographic rare card. All right, Jirachi. Give us that luck and we'll do like a dance or something if we get like a very nice card. All right. Let's see what we can get. I'll say Leaf. Yay! Out of all the packs so far, that is the second Guess the Energy game that I finally got right. All right. Pupitar, Fisherman, Super Scoop Up, Sneasel, C dot dot, Gulpin, C dot dot dot, Beldum, Heatran, Reverse Rare. So we're finally getting some Reverse Rare Holographics. Can barely see it, but Steel Tackle, 120 damage, and an Exploud, non-holographic rare card. All right, got plenty of packs to go, but it is semi-winding down in this new Pokemon card Celestial Storm booster box, an English booster box. And uh, I hope everybody has such an amazing time at your pre-release events. They are so much fun, and it's such it's just a treat, uh, Lightning, to meet other Pokemon card enthusiasts and fans of the Pokemon game. Laldred Energy Recycle System. Shrine of Punishment! A Sneasel. I feel like... I feel like the Shrine of Punishment card is the card that we should all just yell out. Shrine of Punishment! Sounds like something from like the Justice League or something. Back at the Shrine of Punishment, Beldum, Whalmer, TV Report. Oh, 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 very nice. Ultra rare GX pull. So happy. Very nice. That's only our second ultra rare pull, which is pretty crazy to think. But we've already had some incredible pulls in this booster box, including the Rainbow Brush. I don't know the card prices right now because this is probably one of the first openings of Celestial Storm, so I don't really know what's like in need, but y'all can definitely know, especially for people that see this video later on, if that Rainbow Brush was an incredible card, like the card to pull, but we'll see. Psychic. Hopefully y'all have been doing the Guess the Energy game because I have been forgetting because I've been talking so much. Oricorio, Bagon, Baltoy, Beldum, Lotad. C dot dot, Tropius, and oh, a Mr. Mind GX! Oh my gosh, that is so creepy but awesome at the same time. About time Mr. Mimes got some love after getting no love from Ash Ketchum's mom in the anime. <laughs> or whatever was going on there between you and me. But Mr. Mime GX, that is such a hilarious card. One of my favorite cards. Mr. Mime, not the biggest fan, but that is just such a different card that you just don't see ever, if not never before. And we now have it. Pretty cool. Starting to get some ultra rares. Lightning. And uh, hopefully we'll get a uh, Articuno one. Huntail. Huntail. Copycat. Pretty cool looking card. Nice Pikachu in the background. Interesting. Lotad. Fanfi. Wingo. I like how we're still getting plenty of cards that we just haven't pulled before. Very interesting. And a Manet like this one. Manectric. It's jumping off a cliff. Hopefully it's not pulling a Lion King or something like that, and he's okay. All right, next pack, we got a Jirachi coming up. And, uh, yes, these are the codes that I'm giving away, just like this fire. Okay, not so much luck on that, but I think, oh. Oh, that's so cool. Now, instead of the plus, so we got the Minim. Looks like they're like Goku and Vegeta fighting out in the desert or something there. Tate and Lisa. Interesting. Cactur. Wow, this pack has plenty of cards that we haven't seen before. Trico, Whismer, Voltorb, The Slug, Surskit, Shrine of Punishment! Meanwhile, at the Shrine of Punishment, a Waylord. But look at that, 200. This attack does 40 less damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. But look at that tank! It's a tank over here, Waylord, 220 HP. Blaziken's seen better days, or at least this pack has. 
course there's gonna be like a super rare card in this pack the pack that like the bottom of it is little moving over all right guess the energy game i'll say fairy yay i think that's like four guess the energy games right very nice Ooh, scytha scytha how's it going matang that's also those two, those are two new cards right there like this one electric torchic onyx sneasel oh and a prism star jirachi Probably gonna be my favorite Prism Star card there is. A Jirachi Prism Star card. Wish upon a star. If you took this Pokemon as a face down prize card during your turn and your bench isn't full, before you put it into your hand, you may put it in your bench and take one more prize card. Perish Dream. Very nice. And a Swamp Hurt. I haven't pulled that one before, but a Jirachi. Very, oh man, I am absolutely loving this set, mainly because we got nostalgic cards mixed in with some very new Pokemon getting some love, or old Pokemon, I guess you can say, but they're getting love for the newest, freshest time. Uh, I'll go with Leaf. Water. Maybe I should say Water. I don't think I've said that before, but anyway, there's the copycat card. I wonder if that's a full art trainer supporter card because that is a very gorgeous looking card, and I can only imagine what it looks like in holographic -y form. Torchic. Minior and a Regirock. He's pissed off with hammer arm, hitting up the, the ground for some reason, pulling a Voltorb. All right, I think we got, well, we have five packs remaining. Hopefully y'all have been taking count of what your favorite card has been in this opening. And hopefully we'll get some more amazing ones. Um, water? <laughs> Lightning, of course. It would be the weakness. Uh, Dun Sparse, Last Chance, C Dot, Clampurl, Fanfi, Electric, Torchic, Sceptile, that is a reverse rare holographic card, and <gasps> Tate and Lisa! Oh my gosh, I'm so spinning everywhere! We got another trainer supporter card! This has been an insane box! That is gorgeous! I never get multiple trainer supporter cards, and I think those are some of the most gorgeous cards there are in the Pokemon card game. Tate and Lisa, choose one. Shuffle your hand into the deck, then draw five cards. Switch your active Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. That is gorgeous. I, I am set already, and we still got, we got four packs remaining. Are these all the artworks? Yes. You can once again let me know in the comment section below which of these artworks is your favorite, which of the cards have I pulled first for your chance to win this. Cell Shield Storm pre-release box. Alrighty then. I'll just go with whatever I grab the packs at and uh, see what we can do. That was fantastic. Alright, I'll go with uh, Psychic. Ah, no! Fine, fine. Sky Pillar, but it's not the Shrine of Punishment, so it's not the same. Lure Ball, Cdot, Beldum, Shoop, Mudkip, Torchic, Lotad, and a Metacham. Doing some, like, piccolo training at the beach or something. I don't know, but... All right, three packs remaining. Let's at least get one more great pull. But would that be pushing it, Heart Squad? I don't think so. I'll go with, uh, Fire. Yes! If in any case, we've gotten, like, four or five Guess the Energy games. I think that was four, so I really, really can't complain. Friend Ball, Rare Candy, Skitty, Lotad, C Dot Dot, Beldum... Ratata, the reverse super scoop up and Manectric. Super scoop up for your pet needs. Probably my two favorite artworks, unless Jirachi was on one, which I think it was. And that's a good one too, but what can I say? Blaziken's pretty cool looking. All right. Ooh. Nice looking done pack right there, Leonhart. All right. Let's see what we can do. Guess the energy game. I'll go with Lightning. Fairy. All righty then. Haven't pulled too many holographic cards, but the ones that we have pulled have been gorgeous. Slugma, Larvitar, Whismer, Whalmer, Bellsprout, Gordbice, and it would be Deoxys holographic card. Every single Deoxys card in this set has been different, and it has been beautiful. It's Power Blast 110, 110. 120 damage. Very nice looking holographic card. All right. It would be only appropriate that the last pack of this Celestial Storm booster box is the man himself, Rayquaza. Now, we did pull the Ultra Rare Rayquaza GX in this opening, but can we get 
some last pack magic heart squad let's see if we can here we go let's end this off in style heart squad guess the energy game psychic of course well there's that but all right here we go matang apricorn maker hiker seriously that would be hilarious if that's a uh Full Art Trainer Supporter card. Baltoy, Wingle, Metatite, Laldred, and an Electrode GX card. Oh my gosh. What an amazing way to get some last pack magic heart squad. An Electrode GX. And this time, the man is pumped. He is excited. He ain't pissed off of anything. An Electrode GX card. That is beautiful. How about that last pack magic heart squad? That is amazing. Oh boy. The pulls have been absolutely insane. By the way, be sure to enter for this pre-release Celestial Storm box. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, and get ready. Probably one of the best booster boxes of Celestial Storm you're going to see. Because, like, the pulls have been absolutely amazing. So, Electrode, Deoxys Holographic, Tate and Lisa, Full Art Trainer Supporter Card. Yeah, we pulled two of those, or at least pulled uh, two Full Art Trainer Supporter Cards. Jirachi Prison Star. Good to know that the Prison Star cards are actually pretty rare. Like, this is the only one we pulled out of this entire one. Don't know what the other ones are, but I'm glad we got Jirachi, because Jirachi is very cool. Mr. Mime GX. Another very, very nice card to see Mr. Mime getting some love. And uh, just a cool looking card. It's a very, very different looking card. Another GX card. Rainbow Brush Secret Rare card. I'm telling you. Gorgeous. Love the different colors on it. This even could be the card to pull in the set. I don't know yet, but we will be like when the time I opened up an Ultra Prism booster box and I pulled the Cynthia Full Art Trainer Supporter card. Little did I know it was the most expensive card in the set. So let me know if that is. Salamance. A Kyogre. Slacking. By the way, if y'all are interested in purchasing these cards, uh, definitely let me know. They probably will go very, very fast. Slacking. Ludicolo, Tyranitar, reminds me of EX Rocket Returns, Team Rocket Returns, and TV Reporter Full Art Trainer card. And then, of course, the man himself, Rayquaza GX. Gorgeous pulls. Seriously, Heart Squad, this has been absolutely an amazing opening. I hope you enjoyed this early English Celestial Storm booster box opening of Pokemon cards. And get ready for your pre-release events. Check out the eye right over here for some incredible videos. I promise you, you are going to enjoy them if you haven't seen them before. Went to Vintage Pokemon Card Heaven. Opened up every single English booster pack from base set to now Celestial Storm. And uh, it's been fun, guys. Uh, look out for the pre-release box opening and some more Celestial Storm coming up soon. My name is Leanheart. Stay awesome, stay positive, and as always, I will see y'all in the next video.